Hey, welcome to PNW Enduro. You can see I'm on the blue bike today. Familiar blue fender and Astra handlebars. There's something a little different about this bike today. See if you'll notice it. So yeah, there's a couple more strokes on this motor. This is the 2021 Sherco 300 SEF Factory Edition. So a little bit different than most manufacturers are doing 350s. Sherco's got this 300. I've been wanting to try this bike for a while. I don't ride four strokes all that often, but I do enjoy riding them for sure. So I find the 350s are sometimes a bit of a handful in the slow technical single track. So it'll be interesting to see how the 300 does. Bike's got about five hours on it, so pretty much brand new. Suspension feels awesome. Nice and plush. So the steering radius on this bike feels really good. Definitely a different uh, power source than what I'm used to with the uh, two strokes. But it's getting over this chop quite nicely. Sherco doesn't really list the weights of their bikes. It's hard to find, but apparently this 304 stroke is actually lighter than my 302 stroke Sherco. So that's interesting. bike definitely still has the same quick turning characteristics and handling as my 300 SE. So it's quite familiar in that respect. Probably helps having the same handlebars as well. Definitely a bit more of a planted feel like the Fork Strokes have. So here is the 2021 Sherco 300 SEF Factory 4 Stroke. 300cc 4 Stroke is not something you see very often. So it's kind of unique to Sherco. Uh, fun bikes to ride so far. So first gear on this bike is really usable. Can kind of motor through anything in first gear not too slow and a little better at not stalling us
quite a technical section there. It's able to crawl through, no problem. Again, the suspension feels great, particularly the forks. So plush, soaks up those big rocks. Yeah, that was good. I went out left all the way. So at the beginning of the day, I thought I wouldn't really be able to do that kind of technical stuff on this bike very well, but getting through it okay now. Just takes some time to adjust your riding technique a bit. Beautiful day out, awesome day to be testing a new bike. So this 300 Sherco four stroke is probably the most nimble four stroke, the most fun four stroke I've ridden. It feels a lot like my 300 in the handling characteristics, my 300 two stroke that is. Um, yeah, so, so much fun. I'm good to go. Okay, cool. I don't feel like it's lacking power compared to a 350. It's just got so much torque. Gotta be my favorite four stroke bike I've ridden to date. I mean, I was expecting to like the bike because I ride a Sherco now. But I'm really impressed with the uh, four stroke motor on this. Like I said, now I'm a few hours into the ride. Kinda get my technique for four stroke down a little better and yeah it's a blast really fun bike so this bike the add-ons let's go over the add-ons on this bike a little bit very similar to my bike it's got the tusk full wrap guards astra off-road chris birch bend bars bulletproof designs rad guards axp full skid plate and AXP chain guide. And I think that's pretty much it for the add-ons on this bike. Uh, gummy tire, of course, and uh, this bike's running HD tubes front and rear. I'm getting sections of this trail where I think I'm gonna struggle or get wheel spin. And this bike just tractors over everything.
after struggling a bit in the morning. Feeling pretty comfortable now. Yeah, so Russ is in front of me limping his bait out of here. He popped the rad hose, lost all his coolant, so we gotta get him back to the trucks. But yeah, my thoughts on this uh, 2021 Sherco 300 SEF. After spending the day on it, I'll admit the first couple hours I struggled on this bike. Uh, not a four stroke guy admittedly, but after I kind of got used to the power delivery. Um, this bike is really good. I would say it's pretty easily the favorite four stroke I've ridden so far. Yeah, so this bike handled everything I threw at it today. We did a little bit of fast and flowy stuff and uh, actually some pretty technical hard stuff too more than I was expecting to do on this day. Um, it's because I'm so comfortable on this bike after a couple hours. So this bike has given me the same feeling as my 300 two-stroke, where at the end of the day, I'm just having so much fun, I just want to keep riding it. that's the sign of a good bike when you just want to hit one more trail and one more trail all day hopefully get to ride this bike back to back with my Sherco two-stroke see what they're like on the trail <laughs> 